Hello, this is episode 14 of Breath of the Wild. I don't know what to do anymore. I'm kind of just still wandering around. But I say we go back. Let's wander up here a little bit. Mm, maybe. Oh, not that one. Okay, I want to go in the fairing, not gonna lie. We're back here, and I wanted to go north. So let's jump off this side of the tower. Alright! Mm -hmm. oh, I kind of want to go to Lenayru, but I don't... I could go over here. There's some there's some stuff over here. In that case, I wanna go to Kakariko Village. We can maybe get our first memory. That's where one of the memories is. I'm here I'm gonna go to the Great Fairy and upgrade some of my armor. Bloopy. Bloopy. Oh, I should get a picture of it while I'm here. Where'd it go? I wanted to come back. Come back. Come closer. Please. Please come closer. I really want you. Here's my back. Mm. Yes, ah. I would like to upgrade my stuff mm. less. Yes, 
I want to upgrade all the stuff. Now I have actual good defense. Okay, come on. Bye bye. Okay. Now to Lanayru, which is actually very close. This is quite convenient, actually. Not me to press that button, but okay. Crickets. I'm gonna get a picture of them. I'm going to. It's gonna happen. Come on. Come on. Please. Please. Oh, did I get it? It's gonna happen, guys. It's gonna happen. Oh, look at this. Looks like a Korok scene. What the heck? Stupid goat. Why are you trying to run me over, bro? Dumbass little goat. I'm not even doing anything, Dan. Oh, please just go in. Please go in. There we go. Yeah. Yaha. The name of the road, West Gate. Do I trust this random person on the side of the road? No, I do not. Plus he's got a creeper stash. Look at that creeper stash. Nope, not talking to him. And is that a Korok seed I see? If they made me climb all the way up this dumb mountain, no thank you. But it looks like another Korok seed. Not the blue one. Okay, bye, little dude. I 
And it is here, my friends, that we have our first memory. Oh, I want the cricket. Oh, come on. So sad. Where's the little light, glowy light thing? Where is it? I know this is it. Where's the little light thing? Is it over here? Is it looking this way? East Gate. I bet it's the other one. That's annoying. Do I gotta walk all the way across? Yeah, because usually what happens when you come to a memory spot is there's like a little like golden shimmer of light and then you stand there and then you like have a flashback but apparently this ain't it. So now I gotta go to the other side. Probably get beat up by a bunch of monsters, per usual. Oh yay. I don't even have that many weapons. This is gonna be kinda sad. What I do have though is those little metal crates. Give me your club. I want it. Oh, no, I don't want to climb down. No, 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 no. Come over here. No. There we go. See, it's already not fun. And I've been doing this for like two minutes. I'm just gonna do precautionary eat this now. Because I have a feeling it's not gonna be a fun time. It looks so cool over here though, all the ruins and stuff. Shock arrows. There's a shrine nearby. Oh, it's inside the waterfall. Yeah, I'm not. I'm not about that right now. I'm just gonna go around. I will put a stamp here. I know there's a shrine back here somewhere. Froggy! More froggy! Yeah, I really want to be able to have a Korok seed so I can use the boat and get over there. I mean, I could just like climb the mountain, and but like, I don't, I don't want to do that right now. Not a black one. Just little buggers. I don't like it. I don't like it at all. Sp 
spiked Bogo Bow. Not bad, okay. The nice thing about mobile ones is if you get close enough to them, then they can't hit you because their arms are too big. There we go. This has got to be the one. What is that? This is it, boys. There we go. There's... There we go. Oh. Don't keep us in suspense. How'd everything go up there on the mountain? <laughs> so you didn't feel anything? No power at all? I'm sorry, no. Then let's move on. You've done all you could. Feeling sorry for yourself won't be of any help. After all, it's not like your last shot was up there on Mount Lanayu. Anything could finally spark the power to seal Ganon away. We just have to keep looking for that thing. That's kind of you. Thank you. If I may... I thought you... Well, I'm not sure how to put this into words. I'm actually quite embarrassed to say it. But I was thinking about what I do when I'm healing. You know, what usually goes through my mind. It helps when I think, when I think about. Let's stop wasting time. We're gonna need everything we got to take that thing down. Now, champions, to your divine feasts. Show that swirling swine who's boss. Think we'll need to meet Ganon head on when we attack. This needs to be a unified assault. Little guy, 
You get the Hyrule Castle. You can count on us for support, but it's up to you to pound Ganon into oblivion. Come, we should go. We need to get you someplace safe. No. I'm not a child anymore. I may not be much use on the battlefield, but there must, there must be something I can do to help. I I vividly remember the first time I had a memory, and I don't remember if it was this one. I'm trying to think. This one was my first memory like ever, and I just remember being so captivated by the cutscene, and I was just so good because it, it finally like these cutscenes, you know. Like, the game seems very, like, yeah, you can just wander around and do whatever, but they just add, like, a whole other layer to it. And it's so satisfying to, like, see all of it put together. And once we get all 12, we're gonna watch them all in order. And that's when, like, stuff really hits different, is when you watch them all in order. Honestly, Nintendo did a very good job with these cutscenes. And like, there, there are some things that I'm noticing now about the way they cut things and the way that things are referenced that it makes sense to me now that I've like seen the game and like gone all the way through it. But obviously you don't pick up on those things unless you've played the game a hundred times like I have. Now we gotta go back to... Here. So now we're gonna go back to Info and be like, look, I I discovered a memory. What do you what do you wanna give me? She was, sleep she was snoozing over there. Uh. Now that you've seen some of the princess's memories, you must have started to remember certain things. Here, I will hand this over to you now, before I forget. Ayo! This is something of yours that I have been keeping safe by request of the princess. This clothing was specially made for you when you became a champion. Please handle it with care. Alright, we gotta look swagger. There we go. Now I gotta figure out what to do now. Ooh, I could talk to this guy. Oh, it's you. Great timing. I have some great news. I did more research regarding the Great Fairy Fountain, and I have a lead. However, although I know of the spot where it's likely located, it's really hard to get there. I'm not sure I can do it. Sigh, even if it's just a picture, I'm dying to see it. Alright, bro, I'll help you out. Oh, I knew it. I just knew there was someone who liked me nearby who appreciates true beauty. Sadly, I can't pin down the exact location of the Great Fairy Fountain. I haven't put all I haven't put it all together yet, but there's a suspicious place I have my eye on. In fact, I was about to lead head there now. Would you like to come along? Yes. Great answer. Just what I expected from a fellow beauty connoisseur like you. Alright then, follow me. This is part of a main quest. And I already found it. Funny. Bro, am I doing being old and slow? Bro, you... I'm trying to take a picture of the fireflies.
I'm going to be like, I can't go any further because I'm so tired. Hills aren't easy for old fogies like me. Sorry, but I th can't think I can go on. The Great Fairy Fountain should be along the path that leads past the shrine. That's what I've been told anyway, yeesh. I'm completely out of breath. That always happens right about here. Pant. I think I'd better rest for a bit. You go on ahead. And hey, if you find it, don't forget to take a picture. Word. Okay. I wonder if he went all the way back down already. Or he's still standing there. Don't be still there. I'm back. Someday I hope I can see that place spoken of in whispers, veiled in mystery. The great fairy fountain. Yes. Ah, you found it? Really? Are you serious right now? And if you are, then where's the picture? You remember to bring the picture, right? This, this is the Great Fairy Fountain? It's certainly beautiful, but I thought it would be more sacred and elegant. Well, I'm impressed you found it. I want to give you something to show my appreciation, but I don't think I have anything on me. I know. Is there a place you've been seeking? I've traveled all over Hyrule, so I might be able to help you find it. A locked gate with a snowy mountain beyond it. Oh, I know that place. There is a big mountain east of this village. It's called Mount Laneru. At the base of Mount Laneru, on the west side of the nature snowfield, lies that gate. I'm almost certain. I'm glad I know about that location. I suppose my help was useful then. No, it wasn't actually, because I already went there. Okay, so I want to find the item shop, and I want to take a picture of them. I would like to take a picture. That's stupid. Also, if you hear people talking in the background, that's my dad and my brother. They're talking about dinner. <laughs> Made some arrows. Okay. Okay. And that get all the arrows. No, no, no. I'll take them all. Hey. Okay. worth it. Fire arrows are worth it. Yeah. I can't remember the last time we had a customer in here. Young folks in this village don't have much use for a bow. It's a thrill to see a young lad like you come into the shop. Well, don't mind me. Take your time looking around. Also. What you gonna sell? I'm gonna sell you some amber. Mm -hmm. 
Anything I don't need? Not really. Now I'm going to go back to the clothes shop and try and buy the stuff on her. I'm going to buy all the stuff. Of course, my dog wants in as soon as the door as soon as the door is closed. Typical doggy. There's no big expensive. Ooh. I'll take it. What is this book about? Oh my gosh, it's rumor mill. It's like the gossip magazine of Hyrule. I will read. Who loves gossip more than, than a solid three meals a day? Tracy, of course, and anyone else reading this, I'm sure. Today's gossip spot is the Lover's Pond. Legend says that those who find this pond are sure to also find their true love. Sounds worthwhile to me. Tracy's recommendation. Five out of five. That was sh short but sweet. Alright y'all, I think we're gonna end this episode just a couple minutes early. Mostly because my dog is being annoying. And I kinda need to get up and stretch because I've been sitting for a while. So, we made good strides. We found our first memory, which is very good. And we got the stealth armor, which is so nice. It looks, it looks very sweet. But it offers, like, zero protection. So, next time... We'll do something. I'm not sure. But. Oh, might as well take a picture. I got all the Boko stuff to, on today. And from Link. Link says bye. Bye. Wait, what's this one? Nope. See you next time. Thanks for watching.